International Criminal Court Issues Arrest Warrant for Putin Over Russia's Alleged War Crimes in Ukraine The International Criminal Court said Friday it has issued an arrest warrant for Russian President Vladimir Putin for war crimes, because of his alleged involvement in abductions of children from Ukraine. The court said in a statement that Putin is allegedly responsible for the war crime of unlawful deportation of population, children, and that of unlawful transfer of population, children, from occupied areas of Ukraine to the Russian Federation. It also issued a warrant Friday for the arrest of Maria Alexievna Lvovobolova, the Commissioner for Children's Rights in the Office of the President of the Russian Federation, on similar allegations. The ICC said that its pretrial chamber found there were reasonable grounds to believe that each suspect bears responsibility for the war crime of unlawful deportation of population and that of unlawful transfer of population from occupied areas of Ukraine to the Russian Federation, in prejudice of Ukrainian children. Over the course of the last year, the prosecution, as well as the Ukrainian prosecutor's office, has been gathering evidence from a multitude of country and individual sources. CBS News' Pamela Falk reported earlier this week that ICC prosecutor Karim Khan was preparing to seek arrest warrants for individuals involved in the alleged abduction of Ukrainian children and targeting of civilian infrastructure. Earlier this month, Ukraine for a fourth time. I leave Ukraine with a sense that the momentum towards justice is accelerating, he said in a statement. Russia's foreign ministry responded to the arrest warrants with a statement saying, the decisions of the International Criminal Court have no meaning for our country, including from a legal point of view. Russia is not a party to the Rome Statute of the International Criminal Court and bears no obligations under it. Lvova Belova, accused of spearheading the program of transferring children, defended her conduct. What I want to say, firstly, it's great that the international community has appreciated the work to help the children of our country, that we don't leave them in the war zone, that we take them out, that we create good conditions for them, surround them with loving caring people, she said.